Hi guys, welcome back and welcome to my spring style guide. If you've seen my autumn and winter style guides, you'll know how these work already. If you haven't, then I will link them below. And basically there are three categories, style, home and nails. I don't really talk about makeup and beauty as much because I do that all the time. This is something a little bit different for the season ahead. So I'm going to start with style and personally in spring I like to revamp my wardrobe. The weather changes and spring summer clothes are so much more fun than autumn winter. So I've been adding a few new things into my wardrobe and I'm going to show you three of my favourites. First of all this white leather jacket from River Island. I love wearing leather jackets all year round but sometimes a black leather jacket can just be a little bit too heavy in the warmer months. So I really like this one. It's actually kind of a bit more cream but it looks really kind of good quality. It feels good quality as well. And although a white leather jacket is a little bit risky, I've been wearing it and I think I've got away with it. I will put some photos and link to my blog post below where I wore it. It's a really nice soft leather and I feel like if you're wearing jeans and a t-shirt, a white leather jacket just makes the outfit a bit more summery than a black leather jacket would. As you guys know, I like to wear black a lot, but when it comes to spring, I like to introduce some prints into my wardrobe. I really like loud, bold prints and at the moment, Oasis are killing it with their prints. I have bought so much stuff. I'm not going to show you because I want to save it all for a spring summer haul but I definitely recommend going into Oasis because they have so many nice prints at the moment I'll show you one item it's this top and it comes with matching shorts and I know some people probably wouldn't wear them together but I like to wear these together I will insert a photo here of me wearing the outfit that I posted on my Instagram which is at Lily Pebbles by the way and I got so many compliments when I wore it I love how it looks together and I literally have bought four or five things from Oasis all with different prints their current collection is amazing my final pick for the style category are these mono white converse so I call them mono whites because they haven't got the red line around the bottom that most converses do so they're called mono white because they are completely white and I love these I've been wearing them so much. I just love the fresh look. I much prefer them to the Converse that have the red, which I think can look a little bit young. These are slightly more kind of classic. I really like them. They're so comfortable. For some reason I find these ones more comfortable than Converse I've tried in the past. I'm not sure what that's about. But I think these look really nice with jeans and with little dresses and shorts. They're so versatile. Definitely a good investment for the warmer months. Okay, so now onto home. And I love kind of spring homeware and just brightening up the home and making everything look a little bit more summery. The first thing I want to show you is from Oliver Bonus, which is a shop, I don't know if it's just in the UK, um, sorry if it is, but they're kind of everywhere around London. And it's a really nice gift shop and they do really nice homeware and books and everything. And I picked this up a couple of weeks ago and it's a cushion. I know it's strange to get excited about cushion, but I love this cushion. It looks like this, it has neon orange and black stripes and it's just so cute. I think it's really pretty and spring-like and something a bit different to put on your sofa or your bed or wherever you want to put it. It's a really like good quality textured cushion cover as well. They also, you don't just buy the cover, it actually comes with the cushion. I really love this. I think it looks really pretty and something a little bit different for spring, summer. Look how cute these are. I picked these up from Sainsbury's and they're Sunday glasses, like for Sunday ice creams. I've got a pink one, a blue one and a green one. And these are £1.50 each, which I think is amazing. I've just love them, they're so cute. I think they'd be so good if you're having little summer garden barbecues or anything like that and you wanna serve up some ice cream or just fruit or even drinks. You could use these for so many things. If you were to use them for ice cream, Sainsbury's also sell this, which is £1.50 and it looks like a little ice cream but it's actually an ice cream scooper and it has this thing that you press to kind of release the ice cream scoop once you've scooped it. I think that is really cute and it goes really nicely with these if you were to use them for drinks, then I would recommend picking up some paper straws, which I know are kind of a bit like Pinteresty, but they are really, really cute. I got these from Tiger, they're kind of half finished now, but it came with some stripy ones and some with hearts on it. And Tiger always have different ones, but whenever I go in there, they kind of have different prints, but these are the ones they had at the time. I think paper straws are really cute. I know you can only kind of use them once and they go a bit funny. Actually, all straws you can use once, but they are more expensive. I just think they look really nice if you do have a summer barbecue or special occasion. It's something pretty to put in your drinks. Final item for my home category is a vase, and I don't have it here because it's actually got flowers in at the moment, so I will insert a cutaway. I bought this from H&M Home, and I absolutely love it. It's really versatile. I feel like you can put any flowers in, and it's always going to look nice. It's a really simple design. It has, like, half frosted glass on the bottom, and the top half is clear. It's a really nice shape. And I'm just really happy I bought this. I don't think I'd owned my own vase before, like a proper vase. I always just found whatever was there. 
and I really like this. This has been living in my office and I've been putting flowers in. It's making me feel a lot happier. Okay, so now onto nails, which is probably my favourite category. You guys know I love my nails. I've got three very pretty spring-like shades here. The first one is Models Own Beach Bag. I've been obsessed with it since the minute I put it on my nails. This is part of their collection, which is like tan enhancing. So they're colours that make your hands look more tanned. And if you have a tan, they look really amazing. So I'm excited to wear this when I go on holiday in August. It's a really bright kind of neon orange but kind of muted down. It's not like an obnoxious neon orange. It's a really pretty neon. I love this shade but I know that Anna had a really hard time trying to find this so if you did want it it might take a while to find it in store. I think Model Zone is sold on ASOS though so I will try and find a link online to this and we'll link it below. The next one is from Barry M and this is part of their spring collection in their jelly range and this is called Sugar Apple. And this is just a really pretty light blue. It's slightly brighter than Essie Mint Candy Apple. And I really like the formula of these. They're really kind of thick and gel-like. And there's something about the shade. I'm so drawn to it. Every time I take it off my nails, I just want to repaint it again with the shade. It's so pretty and I love a good kind of sky blue for the summer. Next up is Topshop Nails. And this colour is called Skip. And it's a pretty pink. I don't wear pink on my nails that often. Although today I'm kind of wearing a pinky purple. But this one's really pretty. It's girly without being too kind of little girly. It's kind of like, it's like a lipstick pink. Actually it's a bit similar to my lipstick today. Hmm. I just think this is really pretty and I love wearing this during the spring. Well I have done so far. So if you're into pink nails I definitely recommend Topshop Skip. Whoa, I caught it in the other hand. So that's everything from my spring style guide. I hope you guys enjoyed that. I love filming these videos. I just love doing like other things that aren't just beauty. I love the home category especially. You guys wait till I get my own place. I'm going to be doing home videos every week. So I hope you're having a nice spring so far and if not maybe this got you in the spring mood. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!